Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I decided to do a you and the other person segment. This is going to be for Virgo, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So we're going to do a side for you and a side for the person. You pick a side, whichever one is yours. Uh, what do we have for Virgo? September. September. You and the other person. What do we got for Virgo? September. Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. Keep an open mind, Virgo. Yeah, your soulmate may differ. It may differ. It's probably unusual. Your soulmate is probably, you know, not your usual type. By the looks of things. What do we got for Virgo? Ooh, death card. Death card. Well, that's a new beginning. Endings bring new beginnings. So that is a release. So we have a new beginning here. We have an ending that allows you to have a new beginning. Oh, geez, they're all going to flop, huh? I don't know which way to take these. Maybe I should just put them back in. We'll look at them, then we'll put them back in. Nine of Wands. Six of Swords. Ten of Cups. And the Lovers. So, we have an unexpected choice in love. And this is your unusual type. I'm going to put these right over here. I think this must be the other person. That's what I feel. I feel like we have somebody here that is unusual to you. This person may have just gotten out of a relationship or they have they may not be focused on a relationship. This is somebody that has faced some sort of challenge. We have a challenge over here. This is this is a this person has faced some sort of challenge. And they're moving in a new direction, not really focused on a relationship. And now they have this unexpected choice in love. This could now, and the thing is, is there's a death. There's an ending here that opens up a door. We have an unexpected opportunity for love with somebody that is different. Somebody that is different. It's almost like this person, and this person's looking over here, they're looking over here at this ending. This is headed towards happiness, but not really focused on a relationship. So we got somebody that has experienced, or they're experiencing an ending. This person has. I don't know if these go together or what. I'm going to leave that over there. See what comes up. New, new relationship. We got somebody that is headed in. Somebody that wants a relationship. So this person is coming in with an offer of love for this person who isn't looking for it. This person isn't looking for it. This person is wounded. This person is wounded. Now this person shows up. And you're like, this person over here is like, no, I'm not, I don't want this. This person's coming in with an offer. Oh my God, this is unbelievable. Look at that, Ace of Cups, an offer of love. This is it. I mean, somebody is coming in. This person is headed in with something very emotionally fulfilling for this person who is wounded. This person's like, no, I'm not focused on a relationship. I just got myself out of a troubled space. I'm still hurt. I'm still wounded. I'm not looking for a relationship. And this angel says, okay, well, here it is. <laughs> Ain't that the way it always is? Yeah, I'm not. I don't want to. This person. <laughs> is ready to take that next step. He's made, the, the decision has been made. This person's like, I see an opportunity for love. I'm making that, I'm taking that step. 
wasn't even planned. This person didn't even plan on it. He just sees the this is a this is an opportunity for love. It was unplanned. This person wasn't planning on it, but it's like there's some sort of feeling there. Yeah, this is an opportunity. This person sees the golden opportunity and takes action. So we got somebody over here that sees an opportunity with this person. This person's wounded, not even looking. Comes unexpectedly. Destiny. Wheel of Fate. It's the universe. So this is a destined thing. Change of course. Change of direction. Oh my God, Chariot. This the person is traveling. This person is coming in. This person may be at a distance. This person may be just arriving out of the blue. Oh, this person may drive for, for a living. He may drive some sort of vehicle. This person um, could be Cancer. Could be a Cancer. Could be a Cancer. Could be a Pisces. Could be, could be a Scorpio. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have somebody here that is totally emotionally balanced. He really is. This person is like master of his emotions. And he is... I'm saying he because that's what I see, but it could be anybody. This is probably a water sign. Okay, it probably is. This person is in the driver's seat. He may drive for something for a living. I don't know. This person is very disciplined. This person probably has something solid, stable to offer, and they see an opportunity for love. This person is making a move. Oh my God! Judgment. This is this this per this person. This is this is some sort of reconciliation. Could be a past life reconciliation. This person may be guided. This person may be guided from somebody that has passed. I don't know what is going on here, but we have some sort of. relationship it's like this person sees somebody it's like it's like an instant kind of thing they see something there's some sort of instant attraction they feel a deep 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 connection and they can't resist it they can't resist it and it's this person over here who is wounded so this could be a like a, a reconciliation with a past life person This person is is going to definitely take action towards this person. Definitely. This person's like, no, I'm not even, I don't even want this. But it's unavoidable. It's unavoidable. This person is blocked. This person is trying to block people. This person, it is, this is blocking. This person is like, no, I'm trying to block a relationship. I'm not even close. I don't want this. And now, it's now this, now this angel has brought in two people together that are meant to be. This person sees it. This person is, is sees an opportunity, a golden opportunity, and they're going for it. So this person is about to come in hard and heavy. I think it is going to be hard and heavy with a whole lot of love. Okay, this is a whole lot of love right here. It is. This person um, is probably... He, he, this person is either drives a vehicle for a living or they're at a distance or they're traveling to you. You know, and, and this is very, very spontaneous. I feel like they, this person gets some sort of awakening or they get some sort of epiphany or they get some sort of notion. This is the one. This is the one. So that's what I feel like this is. I feel like this person decides to take the lead. This person does take the lead. This person sees the opportunity. They they see it as a open door and they 
they go for it. So this person is about to communicate. This person is going to communicate. They're going to come in hard and heavy on, on the love front. It's like they're going to come through with some, they're coming with some sort of emotional support. They're going to be very caring and loving and, you know, they're going to, they're going to, you know, want them, want you to give them a chance. This person is going to want this person to give them a chance. They may say, can you just give me a chance? They may even say that. Because this person isn't even looking. This person is blocking a relationship. This is blocking. This is blocking. The relationship is reversed. But here, around the corner, it's now they got this unexpected opportunity. And this person is unusual. It's like, what? I wasn't even looking for this. So this person, it wasn't even looking for this. They're wounded. This person has got their guard up. Definitely. This person has got a barrier up. And this person's coming full throttle with a whole shitload of love. So I don't know if this, this could be somebody from a past life. This is past life. That one is too. So this person is about to take action. And it's like you can't stop this person. This person is... It's almost like this person is unstoppable. You know, this person is unstoppable. And this person is probably going to be taken aback. You know, like, what? What? Oh, jeez. We got the moon card on the bottom. This is Pisces or Cancer. So, I don't know. It's a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio by the looks of things. Could be a Gemini. But we got a lot of water over here. Whoever this person is, this person is a lover. And this is the lover's card. This person is a lover. They are a lover. And they're coming with the truth. They're not coming with any sort of deception. So, Virgo, I think that you are about to... And this is meant to be. This is meant to be. This is meant to be. This is a soulmate. I don't know what this is, but... Expect the unexpected. Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. This is not your usual type. But it looks to me as though it's it's meant to be. Okay? This ending is going to open up a door with somebody that you are possibly meant to be with. This could be a reconciliation with somebody that you were with in a past life. And I'm not just saying that. That is what these cards, this is destined, this is destined, this is past life. My advice is to give it a chance. Good luck. 